Example number one. Simplify 4x plus 12 over x plus 3. To simplify 4x plus 12 over x plus 3, step 1, factor the numerator. Step 2, cancel out the common factor equivalent to 1. And step 3, write the quotient in simplified form. squared over 6x cubed plus 3x squared. And to simplify 3x squared over 6x cubed plus 3x squared, step 1, factor the denominator. Step 2, Cancel out the common factor equivalent to 1. And step 3, write the quotient in simplified form. Example number 3. 3x squared minus 3 over 6x plus 6. To simplify number 3, 3x squared minus 3 over 6x plus 6. Step 1, factor both the numerator and the denominator with the GCF. Number 2, factor again the numerator completely. Step 3, cancel out the common factor equivalent to 1. And step 4, write the quotient in simplified form. We have x squared plus 2x minus 3 over x squared plus 7x plus 12. Okay. To simplify this example, step 1, factor both the general trinomials where a equals 1. Find the two factors of the last term that is equivalent to the sum of the middle term number. Step 2, cancel out the common factor equivalent to 1. And then step 3, write the quotient in simplified form. 6a minus 3 over over 3 minus 6a okay as you can see positive ang 6a dito dito naman ay negative okay dito negative ang 3 sa taas dito ay positive so pagpapalitin natin sila kailangan magpalito ng pwesto o i-factor out natin ang negative so this will become 6a minus 3 and then Factor out natin ng negative 1, so it will become plus negative 3 plus 6a. Okay, so we'll write 6a minus 3 over negative 1 over 6a minus 3. Okay, and then cancel out, we have 1 divided by negative 1 equals negative 
we have 6x squared minus 13x plus 6 over x minus 2. Okay. So, we will use the AC method. Okay? So, we will multiply the leading term, the leading numerical coefficient by the constant. Okay? So, ano ang uh, sagot? 6 times 6 equals positive 36. And since this is positive, it must be like sign. Like negative. Okay? So, negative siya. So, what are the factors of 36? So, it's 9 and 4. So, that the sum is negative 13. Okay? So, we will just copy that. Making it 4 terms. So, we have negative 9x minus 4x plus 6. Okay? Then, copy the denominator 3x minus 2. Okay? So, we will group this and then group this with positive or plus. Okay? What's the GCF? The GCF is 3x. So, we have 3x minus uh, we have 2x minus 3. Okay? Plus What's the GCF between these two? We have neg negative 2 times neg negative 2. So, we have 2x minus 3. Okay? So, to factor, we have 2x minus 3. 3 x minus 2 okay. all over 3x minus 2 ok so cancel it out so the final answer is 2x minus 2 sample number 7 we have x cubed minus 8 over x minus 2. Okay? Example of difference of 2 cube. So, we have the cube root of x cube is x and the cube root of 8 is 2. Okay? So, square the first then multiply and then square the last. Sample number 9. And x squared minus 2x plus 4x minus 8 over 2x squared plus 3x plus 8x plus 2. For number 9, we have four terms on both numerator and denominator. So, step one, factor both the numerator and the denominator by grouping with the GCF. Step two, cancel out the common factor equivalent to one. And step three, write the remaining factors as your final answer.
10x squared plus 9x plus 2 over 2x squared minus 3x minus 2. Okay? So, as you can see, we will use again 10 times 2. So, we have 20. So, to make it 9, we have 4 times times 5. Okay, 4 times 5. Okay? So, we have 10x squared plus 5x plus 4x plus 2. And over, factor natin, we have 2x and x, negative 2, negative 2, so negative 2 dito, yung negative 2 dito, dito ay 1, so, negative 2, and this is 1. This is 1. So, we have negative 4 plus negative 1. Okay? So, factor of 